So I was on stream with my partner and completely forgot I was supposed to do a video. Uh, oops. So this one's a little tired and a little on the calmer side. And you can probably tell voice is a little raspier than usual. So you might enjoy that. You might not. Who knows? But let's get to it. Tumblr. Anyone available to go scream in the woods with me? It's fun, free, and the trees like to gossip about us afterwards. Now this is the kind of socializing I'm comfortable with. Perceive. Two of them. Two of them? Oh my god, two of them. Believe it! You know, sometimes a guitar riff is to sound what a garlic hitting hot oil is to smell. You know what I mean? Yeah, I do. Horse girl polycule voting on issues in the stable like, all again say nay. Look, I know this joke is reaching the end of its Tumblr lifespan. Sorry for beating, uh, well, you know. They voted unanimously to freak out at a stray plastic bag in the wind, by the way. Well, at least they're in a stable relationship. Writing inspiration. Thor finishes his meal at a small cafe, and the elderly waitress approaches him to clean the table. She puts the dishes on a tray and sets them aside, picks up Mjolnir, wipes the table with a damp cloth, then puts the hammer back down. Have a good evening, dear, she says and returns to work. <sighs> oh my god, my heart. 2023. Please, can we make lasting good life choices this year? Collectively. Why have I now just learned that neurotypicals have complete control over their brain? Like, you guys can just put your brain on silent when you need to? How? Pleased to announce that I am extending my invitation to summon me when I die to those of this realm. Would your dead essence do kids parties? Only if I get to take one of their souls with me. You know what? Totally fair. Agreed. I don't want someone to reject me because of my looks. I want them to reject me because of my awful personality. At least then I will know I'm pretty. I don't think anyone is more serious about urban legends than theater kids. I mean, once a kid had to go home from rehearsal because he said the name of the Scottish play on stage and someone punched him in the face. I love how you also didn't say the name. Of course I didn't. What kind of fool do you take me for? Now, instead of saying, is this real? I ask, is this canon? This is the kind of post you find on Pinterest. The highest compliment. Stop deleting your posts. I want to see your funky little opinions. All right, I will give you one opinion. Ask me. Can cats have a little salami as a treat? No. Cancel Pucky Show. See, this is why I don't share my opinions. Must a villain be redeemed? Isn't it enough that they're bitter, evil, and most importantly, hot? Well, what can you redeem them for? Cool prizes? How does it feel to be the funniest person on my notes? Referring to my tits as the boys. Not because calling them girls would be dysphoric, but because they're like goons to me. Henchmen. Now calm yourselves, henchmen. Yeah, sorry, boss. I got carried away. Toph was shown easily bending a meteorite that Sokka gave her. Meaning that Toph can bend any dirt regardless if it's from Earth or not. Meaning Toph could have definitely bent to the moon, and the only reason she didn't do it was out of respect for Sokka and his ex-girlfriend. Yeah, Toph doesn't know where the fuck the moon is.